It's like I can't do no wrong. Welcome to my channel. So today I'm gonna be giving y'all a tutorial on how I did these bomb faux legs. Like they came out so cute, y'all. They like the distressed look, kinda, and especially for me to do on myself. I feel like this is the best my faux legs ever look because usually they not as neat I guess really my parts not that neat I tried to do like free parts but they not even all the same size y'all but they look good it looked like you know it's giving it's giving what it's supposed to give so I'm happy I'm happy <laughs> but um I don't know what else I want to say I think everything else I included in the outro so without further ado let's just get straight into this video I'm starting off with freshly washed hair and blow dry and you guys I think my hair is really really growing for real. I'm gonna flat iron it again soon but not right now probably in a couple months. But after that I braided my hair in sections and I tried to do free parts it's not the best but they turned out pretty you know pretty okay for me to do it myself. So the hair I'm using is the Bobbi Boss New Locks and this is the 36 inch and this is the um, shade 1B and I'm just pulling some braids out so I can show y'all how I connect the locks into my braids and then after that I'll be showing y'all how I start the locks. Here I put the lock onto a rack tail comb because it's easier to get through the loop that way when you're trying to hook it onto the latch. And I'm showing y'all up close here so you can have a close up and see exactly what I'm doing. I really want to show you off. Fuck God. Pull up plenty of champagne. Coat nice when you curse this name. You called up your girlfriends and y'all curled in that little bitty range. I heard that she want to go and party. She want to go and party. Nigga don't approach up with that Atari. Nigga that ain't good game. So once you pull the lock through, you want to pull the braid through the loop and like tighten it, if that makes sense. I'm, I'm going to show it closer so y'all can see a little better. Right here. So like you pull it through the loop and then tighten it. And disclaimer you guys, I do not know if I'm doing this the right way, but this is the way I did it and I feel like it came out cute. So if you try it this way, let me know how it come out for you. And yeah, just to let y'all know, I probably won't be talking that much throughout this video anymore because it's very repetitive. I'm doing the same thing throughout the whole video until we get to the finished product and then, I, you know, I'll be back. The next step is using the free trust deep wave and this is also also in the shade 1B and I'm going to put the latch through the base of my hair this time and then pull the hair through I make sure one end of the hair is shorter than the other I'm gonna show y'all what I mean in one of these clips soon after I just start wrapping the hair around I wrap mine kind of tight I'm not sure if you're supposed to wrap it loose or tight let me know what worked out for y'all but this worked out for me to be honest because after I wrap it I kind of separate it a little bit which I'm gonna also show y'all in one of these clips
admit it Man, I swear that she can get it Say if you a bad bitch, put your hands up Right here is where I'm separating it a little bit and this is kind of how I got the distressed look but you don't want to do it too much because you do not want your braids to show. Some of my braids did start showing but not for real for real you can barely tell it still looks like the style. When you reach the end of twisting your hair around, I just took some nail glue and put a few little drops, not too much because it kind of turns white if you put too much. So after you put it on there, you want to rub your hands together and this is going to keep your hair from like unraveling. Now we down to our last few sections, so let's get to it. Here is a close up of how I separate the free tress hair before I put it in the latch and put it in my hair. It makes it easier to wrap it around and it makes it easier to basically hide your braid. finished look and y'all it came out so cute if I do say so myself let me back it up okay. so I have them tied around my head towards the back hopefully you guys can see that and they real long. I'm going to show y'all in the mirror actually because they like real long. But yeah. I hope y'all enjoyed this video. I did my edges. My hair actually, I actually like finished this a couple days ago but it's still fresh. So I still got y'all on this intro outro. You know, usually I do it when it get old old. Yeah, usually I catch you when it get old, old, but you know, I got y'all this time when it's still fresh, so hopefully y'all enjoyed it, hopefully it helped y'all, and y'all try it out yourself, I don't know. It took me 
about like a day and a half because my arms began to hurt, y'all. I recognize your fragrance. Hold up, you ain't never gotta say shit. And I know your taste is a little bit high maintenance. Everybody else basic. You live life on an everyday basis with poetic justice. Poetic justice. If I told you that a flower bloomed in a dark room, would you trust it? I mean, I write poems in these songs dedicated to you when you're in the mood for empathy and blood in my pen. Better yet, with your friends and them. I really want to know you all. I really want to show you all. Fuck God. Pour up plenty of champagne. Cold nights when you curse this name. You called up your girlfriends and your. One, two, three. Make you feel lucky. Love. 